Hello everyone, my name is Aladin Bar, I'm the CEO of Robots Lab. Uh, we are here at NCTM conference in Denver, Colorado. Um, it's uh, still cold and uh, snowy outside, so uh, we decided to uh, take several videos to show you what we are doing and how we are doing that. And we are basically helping students to understand all kinds of abstract concepts in algebra and math and science um, using robots. Uh, in the lesson that I'm going to show you, we're uh, going to use a robotic arm, uh, one of our uh, robots in the, in the package that we created, which is called Robots Lab Box. Uh, and using this uh, robot, uh, we're doing a lot of uh, geometry, trigonometry, uh, and pre-calculus um, uh, lessons. Uh, in the lesson that I'm going to show you, uh, we are going to uh, basically uh, teach the students how to calculate the arc length. Uh, students find it really uh, hard because you know, it's, it's pretty abstract. Why do I need to calculate arc length? Uh, I'll never use it, right? Um, so what we are going to do is basically, we are going to control uh, the robotic arm using a tablet. The tablet is of course included in the uh, package, in the robot sub box. And uh, in this lesson, we're actually teaching the students how to calculate the arc length. Um, and of course using the robotic arm. In this lesson, we actually give the teacher full control over uh, the robotic arm. So the only thing that as a teacher you need to, to do is basically hit the start button, the robotic arm goes into um, the base position, and then uh, we can actually uh, slide the radius slider and actually control the radius of the circle that the robotic arm is going to do, uh, to draw. And using the angle we can actually create, demonstrate the actual um, uh, rotation where we are on the circle right now. And of course we can change the radius at any point and show them the different uh, angle as it is. This is just showing the students uh, why do we need to calculate this radius and you know where it will help us. In the investigate mode, uh, we actually give the students um, another challenge which is much more uh, interesting in arc lengths. We have this uh, bar which is also included in the package. Uh, we place it on the, um, on the yellow uh, square on the, on the base and what we are asking the students in this um, uh, challenge mode, in the investigate mode, is basically to calculate the arc length that will take this uh, plastic bar from uh, its position to all the way to the green uh, square on the um, on the grid here. Uh, once the students work on the math, on the radius and the actual angle, it can be radians or uh, degrees, it's up to you as a teacher. We have a different uh, set for, of lessons for that. Uh, once they find the, the correct answer, the only thing that you need to do is basically hit the start button. Okay, and the robotic arm will go, pick up the um, the bar and actually place it on the uh, on the green uh, square and this is a demonstration in real life why they need to calculate and learn um, this abstract concept of arc length um, so yeah that's just another lesson and uh, we're here booth uh, 324 uh, NCTM conference Denver Colorado if you are here we'll be happy to demonstrate it in person thank you